Hey y'all, what's up? My name is Avery and these are the 20 ebooks that I ended up downloading in December. <laughs> So I downloaded all of these books for free or I downloaded them off of Kindle Unlimited. So let's get started. I'm gonna read the summaries for you and hopefully you can find a book that you wanna download as well and I'll let you know if it's still free or not. So first I ended up downloading Forbidden Attraction, a small town shifter romance by R. O'Leary. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you could purchase it for $3.99. Louisa moved to Raven Falls to make a better life for herself, but better isn't working out so well. Her apartment is a dive, her boss might as well be possessed, and the sweet injured dog she brought home isn't actually a dog. Not that the exceedingly attractive naked man in her bed isn't a setup, but it would be nice if she knew who the hell he was. Knee deep in a dangerous investigation, memories missing, and a bullet wound in his shoulder, Jack is running out of time to figure out who wants him out of the picture. In spite of danger, Luis's dark curls and warm vanilla scent ignite a fire within him that he can't quite shake. Sure, he's a shape-shifting monster, but he deserves love as much as the next guy. Jack doesn't have time to dawdle with the sassy brunette, unless he takes her with him. Kidnapped and pissed off, Luis wants nothing to do with the sexy shifter and even less to do with his secret world of monsters and nightmares. But the longer she spends with Jack, the less she can deny the odd pull between them, even if it is forbidden. Then I downloaded Love and Christmas, A Friends to Lovers Romance by Cindy Faria. Um, this is available to purchase for 99 cents or you could also download it off of Kindle Unlimited. Fire cadet Garrett Parker made a deathbed promise to follow family tradition and join four generations of firefighters. That was until his best friend caught him in a situation that could threaten his future. Not only that, but since Maggie has returned to Sweet Harbor, his feelings for her have soared. Too bad she doesn't plan to stick around. Reigning Sweet Harbor beauty queen Maggie Pritchard dreams of applying her veterinary skills abroad. That is if she can pay down her college debt by winning the Christmas dance competition. She just needs to find a no strings attached partner and she has the, her sights set on her best friend, Garrett. Garrett harbors a secret, but he can't hide much from his best friend. When Maggie presents an ultimatum to help him conquer his fear if he agrees to be her dance partner, this might just be his chance to get her to stay. As the two grow closer, the ugly past rears, challenging their friendship and forcing them to make a choice. Will Garrett honor tradition? Will Maggie cut ties and leave Sweet Harper forever? Or will the duo dance towards their uncharted dreams in time to claim their happily ever after? Then I ended up purchasing A Winter Wonderland, a holiday romance novella by Rebecca Hunter. You could purchase this for $2.99. Coming face to face with Jace after nine years is a reminder of everything Selena tried to forget when she left her hometown. A very sexy reminder. And it's even more dangerous when mixed with a little holiday magic. Jace is supposed to be long over Selena, but he still hasn't forgotten that she left for college without saying goodbye and never looked back. She calls from the side of the highway. The temptation to see her again is too strong to resist. Will a taste of holiday magic make the reunion more tempting? Next we have A Peas, Princess and the Pea Retold by Demiza Carlton. Uh, this is available to purchase for $3.99. Once upon a time, promised as a prize to any hero who can slay the dragon, Princess Sativa flees the palace in search of the prince she was betrothed to as a child. But there are many miles between her and the boy who has become a king. Can a lone princess cross the sea and convince the king she's the princess of his dreams? Then I downloaded Blitzen's Faded Mate by R.E. Butler. This is still available to purchase for free. On Christmas Eve, romance writer Charlie watches as something plummets into the woods behind her home. When she investigates, she discovers an injured reindeer who quickly transforms into a man. When Arctic shifter Arian's sleigh harness breaks during the Christmas Eve run, he knows he's lucky to be alive after the fall but he's even luckier to have found his fated mate in the alluring human, Charlie. When Arian contacts his people to tell him the news, he's surprised to discover they don't believe that Charlie is his mate and are coming to see him before dawn on Christmas day. Arian refused to consider life without Charlie and will do whatever is necessary to ensure they'll be together forever. Then I downloaded No Man Can Tame by Miranda Honfler. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you can purchase it for $4.99. After a failed courtship in an ally kingdom, 21-year-old Princess Alessandra returns home to a land torn apart by mutual hatred between the humans and the dark elves. The Beast Princess, as Aless is known by courtiers, confidently sets her mind 
to ways of making peace, but her father has already decided for her. She is to marry one of the mysterious and monstrous dark elves and forge a treaty and go on a royal progress around the kingdom to flaunt their harmonious union. While she intends to preserve the peace, the beast princess has plans of her own. Prince Burion has been raised knowing his life is not his own, but has to be bargained away by his mother, the queen of Nzovola Rozkeva. That's a long word. Um, to strengthen the dark elf queendom. When his mother tells him he is to marry a self-absorbed, vile human, he is determined to do his duty regardless of his personal feelings. After arriving in the human capital, he finds the beast princess rebellious and untamed and not to be trusted. Aless and Vernon face opposition at every turn, with humans and dark elves alike opposing the union violently, as well as their own feelings of dissonance towards each other. Can two people from different cultures that despise one another fall in love? Can a marriage between them bond two opposing worlds together, or will it tear them apart? For good. Then I downloaded A Witch for Mr. Holiday by Deanna Chase. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited, or you can purchase it for $4.99. Welcome to Christmas Grove, where holiday magic and matchmaking is in the air. When Rex Holiday walks into the charming town of Christmas Grove, all he plans to do is spend the season helping out his buddy's Christmas tree farm. What he doesn't expect is for an overzealous matchmaker to slip a love potion into his cider. But the joke's on the resident matchmaker because not even a potent love spell can break through his walls he's built around his heart. But when the girl next door catches his eye, some of his barriers, barriers start to crumble. Still, Rex Holiday's time in Christmas Grove is only temporary. He can't afford to fall in love. Or can he? Holiday Reindeer is a powerful spirit witch who can see the future for everyone, everyone but herself, that is. And when Rex Holiday walks into her life, she sees his she sees his too. He's destined for a corporate job all the way across the country. So when he starts to show interest in her, she knows it's only temporary and Holly's not interested in a fling. She wants her happily ever after, but he's very hard to resist. Can a love spell rewrite the future? If so, well, Holly will need to learn to follow her heart and for once trust what she can't see. Then I ended up downloading Entered in the Alien Bride Lottery by Margot Bond Collins. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you could purchase it for $3.99. There are millions of ways to end up in the Alien Bride Lottery, but it only takes one. Every unmarried female human over the age of 21 gets entered once a year. You can also accept extra entries for legal infractions. Instead of paying a parking fine, for example, you can request an extra entry. Lots of women do that. I mean, why not? The chances are astronomical that your name will get chosen to be one of the hundred or so women who get shipped off to space every year. Even if your name is drawn, the odds are slim that you'll match up with an alien who's looking for a mate. Most of the lottery drawn women come back to Earth every year and resume their lives as if nothing has changed but some don't. And no matter what, getting drawn in the lottery means you have to compete in the bride games. Guess that's where I'm headed now. I only hope I can avoid catching the eye of the one giant rainbow-hued brutes whose mission is to protect Earth and who can claim me as their mate, all because I was entered in the Alien Bride Lottery. Then I ended up downloading Legend of Love, book number two, part of the Muse Chronicles by Lisa Kessler. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you could buy it for uh, $4.99. Callie O'Connor's life has never been the same since the muse of epic poetry came alive inside her. Now she's on the other side of the country working as a civilian psychologist for the Navy and leading her muse sisters in their quest to reopen the theater of the muses. But nothing could have prepared her for Hunter Armstrong. He's a Navy SEAL, driven, confident, and dangerous, and he plans to do more than just protect her. The gods couldn't have picked a better guardian, but as Hunter soon discovers, Callie has some skeletons in her own closet, and loving her could lead to his destruction. Then I downloaded Accidental Affair by Amy Williams. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited, or you can purchase it for $4.99. I've been obsessed with my dad's best friend for as long as I can remember. Let me clarify, I'm not just mindlessly obsessed with him. I actually like Maurice. Letting him kiss me was a big deal for me. I'm still holding onto my V card and I want to hand it over to him every time I see him dressed in a suit. Lucky for me, I say that a lot because I work for him. Yes, he's my boss and I could not stop staring at him, but my heart doesn't seem to care. So when he needed access to his inheritance to help out my dad, I proposed a plan, a fake marriage, zero expectations, no complications. Yeah, right. Who am I kidding? Then I downloaded Locked In for Christmas by Lola Winters. This is available off of Kint Unlimited or you could purchase it for 99 cents. What would you do if you were locked in with your arch enemy on Christmas Eve? 30 somethings Mel Perkins and Anthony Moore are rival employees at CM Claude's, one of Manhattan's largest department stores. 
For years, they've loathed, e loathed each other and the fact that they're vying for the same position doesn't help their relationship. But when they accidentally get locked in the store on Christmas Eve, sparks will fly and they'll discover just how perfect they are for each other in the sweet holiday romance. Then I downloaded Charming the Runaway Duke, a sweet Regency romance by Maggie Dallin. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you could purchase it for $2.99. Can a duke in disguise win his long lost bride? It'll take a Christmas tide miracle. Lady Amelia has never met the man she has been promised to marry and she certainly doesn't expect to meet him at her family home over the holidays. After all, everyone knows the Duke of Harlow never returns to England. He is so notorious for fleeing from obligation and his future wife that the ton have labeled him the runaway Duke. Lady Amelia does not even know what the man looks like. How is she to know that her long lost fiance is the very man she's falling for? That the man who steals her very first kiss is in fact the Duke. In disguise. Then I downloaded Krampus and the Crone, a sci-fi alien warrior holiday romance by Honey Phillips. I downloaded this one off of Kindle Unlimited. JL is lonely. Ostracized by the village like her mother and grandmother before her, she possesses an old witch in order to eke out a meager living selling herbal remedies to people who don't want to admit they may need her help. When children start disappearing from the village, she's determined to find an answer to the riddle. She doesn't expect to find a massive horned alien one who sees through all of her disguises. Since crash landing on KRS-3, Commander Krampsurian de Marchander <laughs> spends his time working on his ship and secretly observing other inhabitants. During his exploration, he discovers a strange, beautiful female. It is an impossible attraction, but when he sees her treatment at the hands of other villagers, he decides she is his to protect. Then I downloaded Chasing Forever, a Sweet Escapes novel by Susan Coventry. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you can purchase it for $2.99. It's been a rough year for Callie Cooper. First, there was the breakup of her seven year relationship and then her beloved grandmother died. But her grandma left her more than just a grieving heart. Before her death, she booked Kelly an all-expenses-paid trip to Kauai. Eight weeks in Hawaii sounds like a perfect escape. Chase Edwards is anxious to escape the cold Michigan winter, his tedious job, and his cheating girlfriend. Luckily, he was able to take a much-needed sabbatical on the beautiful island of Kauai. He plans to relax, do some sightseeing, and avoid women at all costs. But avoiding one woman in particular is easier said than done. When Kelly and Chase meet, they form a reluctant friendship. The more they spend time together, the harder it is to deny their attraction. Neither of them wanted to get involved, but once they do, there's no turning back. Will their time together become a fond vacation memory or do they have a chance at forever? Then I downloaded The Initiation by Nikki Sloan. This is still available to download for free. No one knows how new members are selected to the board of Hale Banking and Holding, but there are rumors of a sordid rite of initiation whispers how one woman and nine men disappear into a boardroom. This time, that woman will be me. The Hale family owns everything, the eighth largest bank in the world. Everyone in our town, even the mortgage on my parents' mansion, and now Royce Hale wants to own me. He is charming, seductive, ruthless, but above all, he is the prince of lies. My body may tighten with white hot desire under his penetrating gaze, but I refuse to enjoy it. I'll make a deal with the devil to save my family and sell myself to the Hales, but Royce will never own my heart. Then I downloaded The Bastard by Lisa Renee Jones. This is still available to download for free. I'm the bastard child, son to the mistress my father's backup heir to the Kingston Empire. He sent me to Harvard. I left and became a Navy SEAL, but I'm back now and I finished school on my own dime. I'm now the right-hand man to Grayson Bennett, the billionaire who runs the Bennett Empire. I'm now a few months from being a billionaire myself. I don't need my father's company or his love. My brother can have it. I will never go back there. I will never be the mistake my father made, the way he was the mistake my mother made. Then she walks into the door, the princess I'd once wanted more than I wanted my father's love. Love. She wants me to come back. She says my father needs to be saved. I don't want to save my father, but I do want her deeply, passionately, more than I want anything else. But she's the princess and I'm the bastard. We don't fit. We don't belong together. And yet she says he needs me, that she needs me. We're like sugar and spice. We don't mix, but I really crave a taste. Just one. What harm will just one taste do? Then I downloaded Taming Him by Kennedy Fox. This is still available to download for free. Alex Bishop is your typical cowboy, charming, sexy, and wears a panty melting smirk. Working on the ranch helped build his solid eight pack and smoking body. He's every girl's wet fantasy 
and he knows it too. Alex doesn't follow the rules of your typical Playboy bachelor. After whining and dining his dates and giving them the best night of their lives, he always sends flowers and calls the next day, even if it's to say, let's just be friends. His mama taught him manners after all, and his Southern blood knows how to be a gentleman. Still, that isn't enough to tame the wildest of the Bishop brothers. River Lancaster has finally met the man of her dreams. Too bad after six months of romantic bliss, she finds out he's married. With a broken heart and blind rage, she books herself a ticket to Key West, Florida. Tired of cheaters and liars, she sets on escaping to forget what he ever existed. Who needs a man when there's an all-you-can-drink margarita bar anyway? That's what she tells herself until she bumps into the right guy who can make all those bad memories disappear, even if it's only temporary. Two weeks on the beach is what they both needed. No strings attached, no expectations, no broken hearts. Too bad the universe has other plans. One that'll change the entire course of their lives in just nine short months. Then I downloaded Knockout, a dark Irish mafia romance by Sophie Austin. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you can purchase it for $3.99. She's my best friend's little sister, so I can't touch her, but nobody said anything about looking. Molly O'Brien is perfect, sassy mouth with sultry lips. She can't fight me forever. That's what I do for a living, kick other guys' butts. Take what's mine. MMA fighting is my way out of the family's mafia business and I won't let anything stand in my way. But Molly's letting her guard down and I'm not afraid of taking a risk. Her brother, my family, her hate of my sport. This is about to get real interesting. Good thing, I like a challenge. Then I downloaded mine, Possessive Aliens, book number one by Loki Reynard. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you can purchase it for $3.99. She's the last human and she's mine. The year is 3,232. I prepared to descend upon humanity and take what my kind have taken for thousands of years, any female I please. But the earth I find is not the earth I remember. The humans are gone, their cities destroyed. I mourn a loss to be seized until I find her, a girl I name one. One female left from billions, one precious gift from a dying planet, one I will make my own. I will possess her, I will protect her, I will never, let her go. Lastly, I downloaded Come to Daddy by Brianna Hale. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited or you can purchase it for $2.99. Rules for the new sugar baby. One, are you worth it? Hell yes you are, 10 times over. Two, hustle big, hustle hard, and get out fast. Three, never ever fall for your sugar daddy. I've always believed I'm not that sort of girl, but when my father's debt to a bloodthirsty crime lord to pay off, I have no choice but to dip into the sugar bowl. Misha, a handsome older billionaire, is willing to pay top price for me. Something about my daddy doesn't add up, but with the debt to pay, I don't have the luxury of being picky. I'm the luxury in his life, his fantasy to fulfill, and I'm going to play my part to the fullest. So there you have it. Those are the 20 eBooks that I ended up downloading in the month of December. Please let me know down below if you have read any of these books or if you plan to. I love to talk to you about them in the comment section down below. Anyways, thank you all so, so much for watching. I will see y'all soon in my next one. Bye y'all. Thank you.